guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video thank you so much for watching so we have a zara haul as you can see from the title and these are obviously my favorite videos to do you know that if you know me zara edit um and i must say this is a very 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 successful haul i've tried everything on and everything honestly fits incredible because i've had a few zara hauls recent not hauls like i've done a few orders which i'm not showing with you guys because i've just not been very happy with the items and they kind of let me down a bit but they have definitely regained my trust in them um and yeah i have a big old box Ugh. here full of stuff um and yeah, I'm excited to share them with you. So yeah, I've really been struggling with my Santorini wardrobe. Like I was trying to get it done like really early on. So I was like prepared and I could focus on the wedding because obviously like I want my outfits to be really good for the whole week. So I was like putting a lot of pressure on myself for the Santorini outfits and the wedding outfits and everything. And I just kind of just had a little word with myself and was like, why am I trying to be someone I'm not with these outfits and just go classic Rachel, go neutrals and even if it's boring, like it's not boring to me, it's the style that I like. So yeah, I had a bit of a shake and I had another relook on Zara and I found some really, really good pieces. I must say my Santorini wardrobe is all neutrals apart from like a couple of bikinis and that's it. But hey, that's me, neutral queen. Like I can't really do much about it, can I? Um, so yeah, let's get on with the items. Okay, so first off, I want to share with you a pair of these trousers. Now, honestly, I think this is my favorite item that I've bought from Zara in a long, long time. So it's a pair of linen trousers. I'm pretty sure they're a linen mix. Let me just have a look. Um, they are... Oh, they're not even linen oh yeah they are sorry they are they are they're 15 percent linen um which like i said before i actually prefer because it makes them not as structured now honestly the color of these trousers is like the perfect shade they're like a really neutral it's gonna be there we go a neutral color and these are honestly such a jack mousse dupe like i even um denied whether to get the jack moose ones i know they're like an investment but i was like i feel like if i get a decent pair of trousers like they'll be in my wardrobe like forever um but zara have kind of helped me out with a couple of hundred pound easily so um yeah they have the fastening on the front there belt loops we have pockets which we love to see and they've just got like the tailored style um like pleat down the down the middle there and they kind of go into like just a little bit wider than a straight leg but not a wide leg it's a really lovely fit and i have a couple of pairs of nude trousers but they're really wide leg and i really wanted something that was not so wide at the bottom um and i just absolutely love these they have the little pocket detail on the back they honestly just fit me like a glove they're perfect on the waist perfect on the legs um i got an extra small and they were 32.99 um so yeah i just got these i actually originally got these to wear as like an airport outfit but they're too nice to wear as an airport outfit i feel like they'll just get like all scrunched so i'm gonna wear these on the first night i think um with the top that i'll show you in a second but yeah i just absolutely love them if you buy anything from this haul like you need these like honestly they're incredible i need to actually check to see if they've got this fit of trouser in any other colors because some of the other trousers that i've got from zara are so long on me like i need to get them tailored where these are perfect and i am five five for reference so one of the tops that i got to go with those trousers is this asymmetric top top so this is one of the which knows oh this oh, i'm gonna get makeup over it this is one of the seamless tops um so i got this one in a medium to large because that's all they had left but i do know from previous experience that there's really not much difference in the seamless range this one is like an off white a creamy color as you can see um and i got this to potentially wear with the linen trousers or also just anything these tops are so so comfortable it was 12.99 and yeah i just really like the asymmetric fit they're just so soft so comfortable and yeah i absolutely love these tops 
And then another top that I got to go with the linen trousers was this satin shirt. Um, I don't know about you, and I don't know if I just think about it too much, but on like the first night of holiday, I just prefer to be, sorry, my head's really winding me up. Um, I prefer to be a little bit more covered. I feel like my tan's not got to that point yet where I'm just like all glowy, do you know what I mean? It's like first, and also that's the first night, the first night we actually will have only been there half a day. So yeah, I wouldn't have been able to get a tan. So that's why I prefer to have something a bit more covered, a bit more flowy, trousers, shirt type of vibe. So anyway, I saw this one. This one I got in a small and it was $32.99. And it's just a really gorgeous satin shirt. It has the cream buttons all the way down. Um, it has the double cuff, which I really like as well. And it's also got this really extra like large collar. So the way I would wear this shirt would be really undone. So you've got quite a lot of chest on show, but it's like flowy, obviously not too much. I think I'll definitely have to wear like boob tape or something. Um, you could also wear like a really pretty, like have it undone and then wear a really pretty like lace bra underneath as well. That would really work. Um, but yeah, I just love the satin with the linen mix. I think it just looks really, really nice. And then I'll probably wear some like heels or like um, heeled sandals or even like sandals to be fair with this. Um, but yeah, I just really liked that. And the satin quality feels really, really nice and really, really soft as well. And then I also got another pair of trousers. Now these have come with a little mark on them. I don't know if you can see that. So it's a little bit annoying. So I might see if I can get it out. If not, I'll have to send them back. I mean, luckily they're on the back, so it's not too much of an issue. But the fit of these is, not again incredible and like i'm scared to like get maybe i could order a new size and make sure they fit the same because you know that sometimes not each item fits the same like if you got one that fits you well like i need to have that one um but anyway i got these trousers in an extra small and they were 45.99 now if you watched my help me choose my hendu outfit video you would have seen that i needed like a pair of white trousers so i went for these and these are in kind of like a a crepe kind of material they have the waistband there with the pockets and they've got the kind of like tailored trouser line down the front there and then these go again they're a straight leg but these ones are a lot more fitted on like your thigh and bum area and then they kind of go into like a wide leg and honestly they fit incredible um i really love the pocket detailing on the back as well i feel like that just kind of like masks your bum a bit having like that extra fabric there which i really really like are they lined no, they're not lined, but I didn't find them to be see-through. You'll obviously see them in the cutaways as well. Um, another thing that I like is that they've done the neutral pockets, so you can't see the pockets through the trouser, which is always a great um, plus point. Um, but yeah, I really, really like these. I did try them on with the corset that I wanted to try them on for, and they didn't really work. I tell you what the white corset did look really nice with I did try it on with the linen trousers and that looked really really good um so and then I got another basic oh, I've got makeup on this already I said to myself I'm gonna save this for Santorini and not wear it and I've already got makeup on it bloody hell I'm gonna have to put that in the wash but I don't want to put it in the wash I always feel like when you put them in the wash they do go thinner maybe I'll just have to live with the fact I've got foundation on the shoulder so i got another racer top i got this one in a small and it was 5.99 and again i just love these for layering they're just perfect and i wanted to wear this um at the airport so i got a fresh one i mean not so fresh anymore but yeah that one there and i got to to wear with the racer top i got these trousers so these are kind of like a chiffon floaty trouser which they're kind of more they feel more of like a smarter floaty trouser rather than like a beach floaty trouser, if that makes sense. They're like more of a satin and yeah, I just kind of have that more luxurious feel rather than like a beach trouser. Don't get me wrong, you could definitely wear them to the beach, but I kind of want these as more of like a smarter trouser than a beach trouser. So I got these ones in a small um, and they were $32.99. They have the drawstring on the front there. They also have pockets and then they just go down into a wide leg. These fit great. So like I said, oh my God, I don't know if I've got such an itchy nose today. Like I said, I'm gonna wear these with the racer top at the airport because we arrive in Santorini at like 1 p.m. I don't wanna have like too many layers on. I might even put like a white shirt over the top of that so it's not too hot. 
um, and they've got this really nice like little detailing. I don't know if you can see that down the side of the trouser as well. They got a little fake pocket on the back there, and yeah, I just really like these. A great little addition. And next up, I got two of the same top in different colours. So as you can see here, I'm very much so enjoying a bandeau. Um, this one is actually from Mango. This is new. It literally arrived like 10 minutes ago and I put it straight on because I've been waiting for it to come. Um, and I, yeah, I just love them for like layering in the summer. Also, if it's like sunny, I much prefer to wear a bandeau out because I'm not here for tan lines. I do not like them. So yeah, I love a bandeau. And then I saw these knitted ones on Zara and I was like, oh my God, I need those in every single colour. So I got this black one. It's like a sweetheart kind of neck line and then it's just kind of like a short bandeau. I got this one in a small and it was $12.99. I would say they look, well, there's stretch in them, but there's not much like personally. I prefer, like, I could easily get a medium, but I prefer the small because I find that mediums, mediums fall down, whereas these are, like, proper stuck to my boobs, so they're not, they're not going to fall down. So, yeah, I absolutely love these. Looks great with, like, the flowy trousers. Looks great with smarter trousers. You can really dress these up or dress them down, and that's what I love about them. And then I also got the nude, which is, again, you're, like, no, they're different colours and they're different shapes, so I can definitely get away with it. And this one's also, like, a thicker rib as well. Um, so yeah, got the neutral as well, same size, same price, and yeah, again, just looks really nice with trousers, just as a layering piece, and I would definitely get so much wear out of those. And then lastly, I got myself a new cap, because we all know how much I love a cap, and I really like this one. It said Los Angeles. I wanted like a navy cap. I have a navy cap from Casual Field and the fit is just not nice. It's like one of those really flat ones and I just don't like it. Whereas this one's got a lot more structure at the front and that's what suits me more. And I was going to get an Isabel Moron one, which they had, which was like more of a blue. But they're like £130 for a cap. And I was like, I only kind of wanted it for like a particular beach outfit that I've well pool outfit that I've got so I was like I don't want to spend £120 if I don't potentially wear it again um so I got this one it was £15.99 I got it in the small to medium oh it's actually just one size um and yeah I really liked it it's kind of like a I like the fabric of it it's like a textured fabric I don't know if you can see that but yeah I thought that was really, really nice I'm not going to try it on now because I'll mess up my makeup and I'm going to try these on again for you and film them so yeah that was the last item from Zara. I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I've actually been on a bit of a roll with shopping lately. I feel like I've gone, it must be a long while with like not a proper shop, which is crazy for me. But yeah, there seems to be a lot more things that I'm liking at the moment, which is great. So I've got um, a couple of hauls. I've got one more haul, I think, coming up before I go away for the wedding. Um, which is kind of like a collective haul or different bits which i'm really excited to share with you that will probably go up next week um because is it going up yes it is going up next week i think next sunday um so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video sorry if i've rambled on so long there um but if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and i shall see you all in the next one mm -hmm.